Mm -hmm. And I have been watching, um, (coughs) while I've been doing that, on Prime. Good morning. (laughs) Welcome to Corona Vlog, day three. So we are calling Vlog 2. We're going to call it Corona Vlog Day Whatever, but a different title each day. And one of you yesterday, knowing what a literary fan I am, came up with a great idea for one of the titles, which is Love in the Time of Corona. Of course, there's a little spoof off a very famous book, Love in the Time of Cholera, so thank you for that. That's what day two is going to be called when I'm done editing it. I stayed up till almost two in the morning because once I get down the coloring rabbit hole, it's hard to leave. So I finished her face through last night and this morning, moving on to her neck now. But look at how uh, I'm so proud of myself. Eyes are not easy to color realistically, but I got that in there. You wouldn't know it to look at it. But in those eyes alone, <clears throat> there is green, blue, black, two different browns, a pink, and a gray. That's all, like, from there to there, that's all the colors that are in there to make it look realistic. Because you got to get the shadow that your eyelid makes on the top of your iris. All those little things are what makes it look more real. And I will put the highlights. I've left the space for the highlights in her eye. When I'm all done, I'll use my little white pens to do that. But I've heard a rumor that Mama Denise is going to fry up some eggs. We've been getting her, uh, on every Monday, vegetables from Mama Earth Organics. It's all organic vegetables. It's a basket that comes. And for $40, they pick a basket of veg. You can choose what you like and don't like, though, and you can change stuff in the basket. And then you can order additional stuff. So I have been ordering organic Kawartha eggs. Mm. So, yes, I've heard a rumor that Mom's going to make a couple of those for lunch. So there's purper, the purper nugget. Say hello, purpers. Hello, purpers. Had her out at 7:30 this morning. Candy was still sleeping, so then I said, "Well, I took her out, came back, went to bed, got up at 11. How decadent is that? So now I'm gonna go into the kitchen and make some our big kitchen, my yeah. big counter. <laughs> Let me take one step and be in the kitchen. <laughs> the stove. And then, um, yeah, and then the, not much counter space, but it's all right. It's workable. You can make a feast in here. And then Candy's editing day two. So I was just outside, and before I doing my bacon, and I just look outside, I'm opening up the windows, and then next thing you see is this big craney thing. Look at it. That just, that's in our backyard. Don't know what they're doing, but I heard some noise this morning. <clears throat> and then it's something out here, down in... Yeah. You know what? Try to do this when you're like I'm going the opposite way, which way your finger should be. But anyway, there's this big crane in our backyard. Wow. Isn't that weird, eh? I don't know what they're doing. Anyway, back to bacon. So they lifted something up and they're doing something in this building behind us. And swinging something big and heavy. Onto the roof. Must be doing some roofing. Or they're replacing one of the many... There's like a big box, big tin box or something that came down from the roof. So I think they're probably replacing whatever it is. Like a... Anyway. These things are huge, eh? Look at the crane. Look at the... Pretty damn big. So they parked on Kiwatin, which is one of the um, streets around our building. Closing that off. Yeah. Anyway, that's what's happening. Okay, I gotta get back to my pan, it's hot. But it does take the egg. It goes another something else. I use one called Mona Lisa. I also have a THC oil, which is the one you saw in the Candy's replying to people's emails. Video. I don't know what that is. It's like a spaceship. Alright, so whoever among you said we might get demonetized because of Corona Vlog, you were right. So we're just changing up that title right now. I am in the bedroom because I have just put on my first mask of the day. 
I always do like a double mask. So this is the Aesop Parsley Seed Mask. There's not very much left in it, as you can see. So yeah, what I will generally do is I wash my face. I put on a cleansing mask, comme ça. So there I am with it on. And then I read the paper and do things like that while I let this all dry. And then I will take it off and put a moisturizing mask on. So right now I'm reading a few books. Any of you who are experiencing midlife crisis, this book, The Middle Passage from Misery to Meaning in Midlife is excellent. I've got my Oprah magazine and my stack of weekend papers. I get both the New York Times and the Global Mail on the weekends. And New Yorker magazine has an article about mountain climbing. And while I never ever wish to mountain climb, I do have a bit of an obsession with people who do. So that's what's happening right now on this lovely sunny Sunday. I hear the sound of pitter patter. Little feet heading our way. And what's that? A tube of toothpaste. I use Colgate Opti White. I love Colgate toothpaste. But I'm also kind of in love with the new Crest Gum Detox, um, which Denise obviously kept for herself. I thought I would get to use one and then go back to my Opti White. Could happen. Denise is also now using a bamboo toothbrush. <laughs> there it is. Is there no This is another one that we enjoy. It's the Crest Charcoal, although all reports are that charcoal toothpaste does not do anything special for your teeth. It doesn't make them any whiter. All the Dental Association of America has said that that's all crapola. That's not crap though. Hey little white hairs. What's up? Come on, Purper. Come on. What if I burn your toast if you do not? Come on, Mama. Everybody used to think that, that made your teeth white too. Burnt mm -hmm. toast. Hi. Pearl Pot. Who's Mama's little baby girl? Yes, oh my goodness, oh my goodness, yes, you're just so beautiful, you're so beautiful, yes, oh, oh you like to have your head pulled, yes, she likes it when I pull the hairs on her head against the grain, as you can see, she puts her head right down. <laughs> so I rinsed that mask off, it's 20 minutes later, and I am now sitting with this one on, this is the uh, Sicily Express Flower Gel Hydrating and Toning Mask. I love Sicily masks. They're just so damn expensive for such a small tube. But every now and then I treat myself. I love this one. And the, uh, what's it called? It's in the dark burgundy tube. It's called Black... Black something. I can't remember, but it's a cult classic. So this will sit for about 10-15 minutes and then I'll jump in the shower. Hello there. Oh my goodness, after my shower, I fell asleep for, what was it, two hours? Oh yeah, till like 4.30 or something. It was crazy. I just, all of a sudden, I was like, I am so tired. <laughs> and I went out. Um, this evening, though, I did some more coloring. If you can see it there in that light. So I've I'm not quite finished the skin on the body. I'm just about done with the dress. Put some cute little polka dots. And now I'm working on her hair. So really, it's her hair and her bow, and then just the finishing touches. Very good, Mama. And we're just wondering what's going to happen. I guess Fredericton is probably I'm going to do it by Zoom because you know I don't want to be exposed in the airport. Um, we we're shocked though that there's some of the clients from May are contemplating canceling, and that's you know two months off. And I'm, I'm hoping I don't know about the rest of you, but I'm hoping we're going to be through the worst of it by then. You know, um, I was reading some things today in the paper and also watching online. Everyone's saying we're overreacting, but the scientists say that that overreaction is what's going to stop it from getting really wacko jacko. So the fact that we're canceling all these public things and that people aren't going to congregate, that that is really going to go a long way to keeping the numbers down, which will keep it from becoming, you know, something... We're, or worse. <laughs> yeah, we're like 40,000 people, you know, um, per country die kind of thing. So uh, anyway, we're, we're hunkered down. We get groceries delivered here on a regular basis. And we're washing our hands, doing what we can. But it looks like I'm probably going to be 
grounded for at least the next couple of weeks. Mm. So writing time, for sure. You should be able to get your book done, right? Absolutely. Yes. Good. Say goodnight, boo-boo. Goodnight, boo.